you know, if you're going to have bulk flow of uh, material, you want it to be consistent, you want it to work, it has to flow. So understanding material characteristics is really important, and that's our business. Measuring flow properties, how does moisture affect uh, material, uh, what happens when it's vibrated, uh, how is it affected by being aerated or when the air escapes from it. These are all really important factors. And whether you're transferring uh, manufacturing cement, fly ash or pharmaceutical product, the same issues arise time and time again. So uh, it's, uh, it's, it's critically important. That, uh, and more and more industry is beginning to understand that. You have to understand the materials that you're trying to process. That's the fundamental line. And if you can do that successfully, you can learn from what you've done in the past. Uh, because in the past you'll have lots of experience, hopefully most of it good, but there will be some bad experiences too. And the, the crucial uh, route to success is to learn from that experience. You have to learn what you did that worked well, and you have to learn from uh, what you did that did not work so well, and find out why. And that's uh, what understanding materials is all about, learning those lessons.